One thing I should note is that in New Jersey, there's no mask mandate. Obviously in Vegas, there still is, so. A little weird, a little weird not wearing the mask to be honest with you guys. Another one. As far back as I can remember, I always wanted to be a We are in New Jersey today. We have made it to Atlantic City and we're staying at the Ocean Casino Resort, right on the water. Hello. We're staying at one of the newest properties in Atlantic City, the Ocean Casino, the five-star Ocean Casino and Resort. So we booked the standard room here and actually this room that I'm in right now is the second room today. Because the first room we walked in and we were a little underwhelmed to be honest. It was pretty filthy. For a five star, apparently, allegedly a five star, we were like, this doesn't make sense. The furniture was just clearly not clean at all. I paid 230 something dollars for the night. So we went downstairs, we decided we're gonna get another room. Maybe, maybe it's just that room, but uh, <laughs> we're in our second room right here. Basically the same level of cleanliness. Um, so off the bat, a little underwhelmed by the standard room at least. I gotta be honest, gotta be honest with you guys, but the lobby area looked absolutely stunning and beautiful. The property itself looks amazing, and the view here is also incredible. It's a fish tank. So we just came to the main lobby area. Check-ins right there. You have a nice little bar, cappuccino place, and a fish tank right here. Also, this is my buddy Josh. He just got here. And he knows all the fishies things. <laughs> he knows all the fish? All Only the some things. of them. Really? Yeah. What's that one right there? That is a tank. That that's honestly a, that's pretty the impressive. That's the damsel over there, the tiny one, the blue one. We are on our way to find some lunch right now. One thing I should note is that in New Jersey, there's no mask mandate. Obviously in Vegas, there still is, so. A little weird. A little weird not wearing the mask, to be honest with you guys. So we just went to the food court, which is inside of a place known as the District. The District is basically like right connected to the casino. It has the food court area, some bars, some restaurants. It's really, really nice here. There's pizza here, pastries, gelato. Yum. They have a Wahlburgers here. Wahlburgers. Whatever those are, I'm a big fan. Big fan. Can we get that for the apartment, Greta? Wow, this place looks cool. I like the De Niro painting over there. So this motorcycle right here, it has NHL branding on it. And I noticed that there's some signatures and I figured out who the signature was. Mark Messe, one of the greatest Rangers and greatest players to ever live. Sign that right there. They also have a Top Golf here. 
Very nice, very nice. In Vegas, the pools are always outside, outdoor pools. But the pool in Atlantic City, or I should say the pool at the ocean in Atlantic City, is indoors. I think there's an indoor section and an outdoor section, but we're about to go to the indoor section right now. I'm pretty excited. So right here is the spa and bathhouse, and right down there is the indoor pool we're going to. Follow the wifey. Oh no, it's cold. I mean, I would say it's cold, but it's not hot. Alright guys, let me know what you think, if this is warm enough. Josh, hop on. Hop on, Josh. It's roped off for a reason, you know? <laughs> oh, it's actually, it's an automatic piano. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. What if I just like, didn't tell you that? Just like... <laughs> <laughs> We just got back from dinner. We're about to go downstairs and Josh actually has never gambled in his life. We just taught him how to play blackjack. We're gonna get his take on playing blackjack and gambling all together for the first time ever, so. Okay, are you ready? I think so. Are you excited? If I win some money, <laughs> I'll be excited. I just awesome. have that I have some big hopes on you because you had some two awesome teachers. That is true. So I'm the, counting on you. Always assume it's a 10 rule. So we're making our way to the casino right now, but I want to, add this before I forget. We have noticed, actually this was Josh's observation, but there's a lot of seating areas at this casino. Just like, you can see like behind me over here, seating area over here, and there's just countless little like open spaces with seating areas, and there's even like a section outside where there's numerous like fire pits and just open areas for socializing, hanging out. Something pretty unique to this casino. So we are looking for an electronic blackjack machine to play so we could film the event obviously but they actually don't have them here so we're gonna have to find one of the tables here I saw earlier there was a $10 minimum blackjack table we're gonna try that and I'll keep you guys updated after you know after the session sessions over I lost 60 and Josh you want to describe your uh, your experience? Well, I learned the most important lesson of all. True friendship is hard to find. No, I lost it all. <laughs> <laughs> Quit while you're ahead, and that's the lesson. Good morning. We have to check out now. It's 11.30. We were supposed to check out 30 minutes ago. I called, and they couldn't offer us late checkout. I couldn't even pay for late more late checkout. They said it's too crowded here. They need to get rooms you know, turned over to new clients. So we kind of rushed uh, our morning routine because we all wait, woke up so late, but uh, all right, we're, we're leaving. Look at this view, the view the other way is way nicer. See, see all these seating areas right outside the elevator? More seating areas, see? All right, that wraps up for Ocean. We're about to head to Caesars now. Overall, good stay, love the property. Beautiful casino floor, nice rooms as well, although they could have been cleaned better. I mean, for a five-star 
our standards are pretty high but maybe that's you know part of the reason is because they're dealing with like staffing issues right now but yeah they have beautiful restaurants really nice casino I like the layout too there's basically like three sections so the bottom section is connected to the boardwalk you go up one that's where the casino is and all like the restaurants and things like that and then you go up another one and that's where the the lobby is the hotel check-in you have a nice bar near you know the check-in area and Cafe Chino, the breakfast and uh, coffee place, which is open 24-7. That's cool. And then uh, that's where you can find your elevators to go to the rooms. The room, you know, the views are amazing. You're looking out at the water, and then the other side you get to see more of like the pier and the other uh, casinos and stuff. So that's really cool. Definitely a different vibe compared to Vegas because of the ocean, you know, that is really cool. And uh, yeah, overall really good stay. Thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, we're going to Caesars now, so. That'll be the next episode. So yeah, Atlanta City, baby. See you guys there.